from Tamil Refugee Council and we're here as um, Elam Tamils trying to show awareness that all refugees need permanent protection. The reason why Tamils need permanent protection is because the genocide that's been occurring in our homeland Tamil Elam um, in the northern eastern districts of Sri Lanka has been going for 76 years and we are unsafe to go back to our own homeland and Australia is our home and all refugees from all walks of life deserve permanent protection and need a better future and they should not be waiting in limbo. I came to Australia by boat in 2012 at the age of 15 without my family. I have been living in Australia for the last 12 years, contributing to society and trying to make most of my life. My case sits in the courts waiting for approval and I have been waiting with many others who are unsure with their case lies and whether we need to prepare to be deported. As an Elam Tamil, we hold the highest rejection rate from IWA. We as refugees ask the immigration department to provide us with permanency, as most of us have lived here, providing the best for the Australian community. Refugees are often left behind, and now the Labour government has cause to feel uncertainty throughout every day. Refugees are discriminated within the fast track system, unable to understand why the process has been taken so long. Fast tracking removes appeals right and has seen legal aid tripped away, leaving many asylum seekers to dealing with our system unrepresented. There are 12,000 refugees unable to call Australia their home, and it has caused individuals who are younger than me to struggle. I have a million nightingales on the branches of my heart, singing freedom, 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 singing freedom, freedom. Hi, my name is Abhishek Selvakumar, and as a Tamil refugee myself, uh, I finished school last year but unable to continue my studies further on due to visa restrictions and like having no work rights or study rights has, uh, has boundaries for me to continue my career and all my childhood school friends have moved on continuing their career or going off to university and I'm being held back due to my visa restrictions and it would be great and I would want permanent protection for all the 10,000 refugees who are being held back and would want us to have a future for ourselves. Second Holocaust, with 2.5 million people being impacted on a day-to-day -day basis that we're watching on our phones, blow by blow, minute by minute, and yet the world is still silent. On this Palm Sunday, and as the global Christian community raises for Easter, we Christian Palestinians find ourselves wondering why so few of our fellow Christians are, use, are not using their, your, oh, are using their voices to leverage our collective influence to advocate for peace and justice in the Holy Land. Refugees! Free! 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 Free